Hello and welcome my beautiful Scott Reminds to an upper body workout. We're gonna work for 30 minutes, so stay with me. This is gonna be intense but also really awesome. And this one is actually the first workout of my full week of workouts. So stay tuned every single day until Sunday to get your sweat on and get fit with me. So let's start. Um, there's going to be like a little bit of warm up in the workout as well, so we'll just get right into it. We've got eight seconds here, and we're going to start with arm rotations. So just forward and make them like bigger in the start, and then you're going to make them smaller. To really feel your upper body muscles working here. Reverse to back. Then really small now. Awesome. Now we got 20 seconds rest. We're gonna do 40 seconds on, 20 seconds off. The next one is gonna be traveling rows. So it's basically rows without weight. So here we go. We're gonna pull it back and feel all your muscles. So really squeeze all your back muscles together. Just imagine you're pulling like something really heavy from the sky. This is amazing for your muscle activation. Perfect. Next up is gonna be boxing. You can definitely do that standing up or sitting down. Doesn't really matter too much. But I want you to keep working the whole 40 seconds, like a lot. <laughs> like give it your all. So punch one, two. And then punch one, two. And you can do everything with the right now. And I'm gonna switch to the left. You're all put everything into it. Some rest. If you Throw in your first punch with your right hand. Now, in the second set, go for your left. Here we go. In the bricks, you can rotate your um, wrists, upper body, do everything that feels good. All right, next one is back squeezes. So on your knees, sitting down, doesn't really matter. Put your hands to the side, and we're gonna pulse it back. So you gotta feel that, like on the muscles at your spine, a little bit your shoulders,
I can feel it here. <laughs> now come to one side. I'm gonna put one hand here. And I just gotta to flop to the ground. <laughs> now we're gonna do push-ups with just the upper hand. So you push your body up and you bring it down slowly. And push it up and come back down. 30 more seconds. This is a little bit for your chest and a lot for your tricep. Start with the push up, down dog, and touch right ankle with left hand, and vice versa. Come back on your knees or high push up, come up, down dog, touch, and touch. And again, almost done, guys. This is not too crazy, isn't it? Breakdancer kicks. So what you want to do is you're on pretty much all fours and then you bring one leg in front, come back, one leg in front. Okay, so here, and then you just basically twist to the side. So in like a down dog position and then bring your light right leg to the left and left leg to the right. Next up, Hindu push-up. If you're familiar with yoga, it's basically like a chaturanga. So you're in down dog, you rock forward. Either you place your elbows on the mat, come forward or not. <laughs> so here we go. So either you stay extended and press forward and then go back. Or you place your elbows on your mat up to you. Okay. 
amazing. How are you feeling? I'm already sweating like crazy. Next exercise is a forearm plank reach out. So we are on the forearms. I'm just going to reach out and reach out. Here we go. Keep everything super stable. Your hips shouldn't move a whole lot. crazy or is this crazy? <laughs> Next exercise we're gonna come to standing, inch forms it is, so it's basically just walking out and I'm walking back. Try to have as much weight as possible on your hands so that you're really working your upper body here. So we're gonna come into dolphin pose, which is basically on your forearms, your bum is high, and then what are we gonna do here? <laughs> okay, we're gonna just push onto our hands. So from here into like a little plank, and I'm back into dolphin. And again, try to activate those shoulders. Squeeze everything in, especially when you lower down, do this really calm and controlled. Alright, 
That's half of the workout done. I'm gonna give you a one minute break. exercise is a plank with a rotation so here plank just rotate everything to the right side back down to the left side and again everything you want to have engaged keep it strong you guys Remember those dolphin push-ups or those dolphin from here to here? Gotta do that one again. <laughs> Get ready. Got five seconds. Come into your dolphin. And press into your hands into a little plank and slowly back down. some supermans with arm extensions so superman extend your arms and back down and we're gonna do that for 40 seconds again in dolphin pose but this time on your hands and you just want to do some little shoulder push-ups so you really want to go here head in between of your fingers and don't worry if you can't lower it all the way if you do a little push-up like that it's amazing as well but try to go as deep as you can Stay up till morning and head out exploring Make up for months that we've missed Cause the cold air is calling And my head's recalling The moment that I was convinced We'll stay up till morning and head out exploring Make up for months that we've missed Cause your lips are calling And my heart's okay. calling Whew, that's crazy <laughs> Next exercise is pretty simple. So it's on your toes here, and we just do side steps. I'm 
Next up are one arm push-ups. <laughs> Don't worry, stay with me. We're gonna do an easier variation of that. So just on your knees. If you can do them fully, good for you. But we can stay here, make it harder the further we go back. So it's just like pushing up. And again, the closer your knees are, the easier it gets. They're really burning. <laughs> okay, next one is for your back. Swimmers lie on your tummy and then we'll just do this. So it's basically alternating. Here you go. And really squeeze your back muscles. Bring your head between your shoulders. And remember to breathe.
next one we start lying on our belly one arm is on our chest and we push up here tuck our toes into down dog and then come back do the same on the other side all right push up with one hand tuck your toes come into a plank down dog and then go back lower your hips lower your chest change side One more. Oh, amazing. <laughs> cool. Um, we've got cactus arms now, so we lie on our belly. Our arms are 90 degrees, and we want to lift them. But pay attention that your hands are the same level as your elbows, so you don't want to do this, you don't want to do this. They're straight and your chin is on the floor and then hold five four three two one lower shake it out and again up and hold and hold <laughs> You got this. Amazing. Okay, plank rotations on your forearms. We did it before on the hands. Now I'm going to do it on the forearms. So we're here. We open. And we change side. We open for 40 seconds. Last two exercises, my friends. Okay, this one is a fun one. <laughs> it's also a tricky one. Um, I'm definitely gonna do that on my knees. You can do it however you want to, really. But we're gonna do a push up. And we're gonna jump from narrow to wide. So you're gonna do wide push up, narrow push up. If this is too difficult, you can always come back a little bit. Let yourself drop. body saw plank so on your elbows in the plank and we'll just rock forward and backward in thighs here we go and make it count it's the last exercise and then you're done
how are you feeling? Make sure to give your arms, your chest a little love. So if you want to, you can continue to stretch a little bit with me. So I'll just stay in child's pose a little bit. Your fingers are active, pressing into the mat and your chest wants to come forward and basically melt over your knees and into your mat. You're still very active here and you want to elongate your back. And slowly walk over to the right side. Drop your left shoulder. Walk over to the other side. And drop that shoulder too. Slowly come back up, take your right hand in front of you, cross it across your chest and pull your shoulder down away from your ear. You did such a great job, I hope you enjoyed this one. Let me know what you thought, what other exercise you want to do and as I said before, this is the first exercise of a full week, so make sure to come back tomorrow to train our legs. I'm so excited for this one. Okay, release. Other hand across your chest. Pull it over and drop that shoulder. Doesn't it feel amazing to move your body and once you're done, all that suffering is just forgotten? Because <laughs> you've been doing so good for your body. Okay, one last stretch. Hands are on your mat, left hand comes up, all the way over. Ooh. And you want to stretch that left side. Take it over to the middle, hand is on your mat. Reach up and over and feel that stretch. You did amazing guys. I hope to see you again next time, tomorrow here on my channel to stay happy and healthy and fit together. And it's more fun to work out in a group, right? And if you can't have or the physical group we're gonna create our own little online community. All right, thank you so much for this one. I hope you enjoyed it and I'll see you soon. Goodbye. <laughs>